Then we have Friday, the first day of the uh, convention. Now with that, we just uh, got all suited up. Okay, ready? Oh my god. Ready, Nick? You guys have to copy me! I need a saxophone or something. No. It looks like a horror movie thing you see in the mirror. Uh, notice wait, 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 wait. It'd be like a, so high it'd be a teenage girl looking in the mirror. Who is it? And then that Hold on, I need a paradox. Fuck this mirror. <laughs> Can I even fit my head? Alright. Uh, uh, oh, I don't like you. <laughs> Open the mask. Open the mask. <laughs> it's like looking into the future. <laughs> yeah, day one morning. 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 Yeah, uh, we're we're all just setting up. It's like what time is it? Like eight? Or... Yeah, again, yeah, like eight sixteen. The convention doesn't with start the tape on it. What kind of convention is this? Connecticut starts at like, like, you know, like, early morning. We get up from Connecticut and we're right there. Even though there's still stuff that needs to be set up. Uh, so, basically, like, nothing's going on, though. Yeah, Zero. Yeah, I'm busy. I'm filming you, filming you, filming you. I'm filming you. We're all filming each other now. Look at this. Come on. Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 let's take a look how ridiculous this thing is on top of this camera. That's the mic. Here, let's turn this Ah, fucking boom that mic. The, it's bigger than his camera. Why is the caterpillar fucking your camera? <laughs> 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 okay, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Ah, taco salad. Stay still. Burger, the burger. I can talk as my camera. No offense. No. Basically, it's going to be a while until we get it's to the something. convention, so... Yeah. I'm holding a camera for now. Oh, I wanted you to say the chorus. I believe! Well, that's like much further than the so... Oh, well, fast forward. <laughs> fast forward in the future. We're gonna have to get on the sidewalk. Well, there you go, there. There's another one. Plane. It vanished again. As soon as I look up. <laughs> Ghost shit. Or post shit, as you call it. Yeah, Anime North is like right near an airport, but we're not going there yet. It doesn't start till like, what, four? Four? Well, well the yeah, programming starts around four. Registration opens at one. Yeah. All right. Wow, pictures are ready. Oh, wow. Oh, wait, let's get out of the way. I wanted to, but this made six hours. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> Where's the flag? Where's the link drop flag? Yeah, I know. Who's that one down there? That's, um, oh, God. Uh, last Airbender. <laughs> oh, it's an Airbender? Mm. Well, well, a character from it, maybe? Well, yeah, a character from it. Right, one, one, one of the, uh, one of the uh, main like waterbender tribes. Uh, I, I, I don't think it's Sokka, because he can't do that. <laughs> oh, God. Wouldn't it be funny? I don't think it was a... No, no, no. It's just a guy dressed in a suit and hat. <laughs> That's what I was saying. Guys, we're kind of in the middle of a walkway. Yeah, yeah let's just get going. We all got on a cosplay thing. This year I went as a new cosplay that I was actually prepping for Kineticon, but managed to get done before Anime North, since I was able to go. And what is that cosplay, you may ask? It's this. Very Burton. Kind of happy with how the costume turned out in time. There, I might have like done a couple extra things I was missing. The gun holster, but that's just a little nitpick. But I'd rather get that done before kinetic on also to be like a little more accurate. Now, Anime North is uh, spread between three different areas. And you can pretty much just walk to them, but there's just one place in comparison to the other two that it is a pretty long walk over a bridge and it's really tiring if you keep going back and forth. 
uh, and that one is the Sheridan Hotel. That one is the first away from the other two, which is the Double Tree Hotel and the actual Toronto Congress Center. Sheridan held like a bunch of like held like a few panels, and I'll get to that later. And um, had like a gaming vendor, which had a bunch of rare games. I actually ended up buying a. I think a game and something else there. I'll, I'll get to what I bought later. Yeah, there and yeah, I'm, it was pretty cool seeing that stuff. And uh, what else? Was, oh right. Then later on, there we apparently found out later on that there was a rock band set up for that. We kind of handled that on Saturday. I'll get to that later. Now the other two places, the the Double Tree, was pretty much where screenings were and and where uh, most of the panels were and that's where Zero Master's panel was at in the, uh, late at night but we'll get to that again and then there's the Toronto Congress Center which is where we had to go to uh, get our badges since since we got lost on um, Thursday I couldn't get it the badge early so I had to wait in line which is mm, not, not a problem but yeah while Zero and all those other guys who were part of the panel, who, uh, they had to get their panelist badge at the Double Tree. Well, me, Blondie, and SCR had to wait in line at the Congress Center for the regular badges. Nice! <laughs> nice! Because I look like Goku. This is the pre reg line right now. Not that big. And right now, that is currently the non pre reg, which SCR is going to have to sit through. And there's Zero Master. I don't know what the fuck you're doing. But it's not even like uh, 3 o'clock. Oh, no, not 3 o'clock. Like, it's not even like 1 o'clock. In 3 hours, it should be much bigger. I don't technically have to wait in line, but I will. Well, I do. I mean, we all do, actually. Well, well don't yeah. Don't get out I think the yeah. fifth spot will just cut in. Well, since you're pre-registering with me, you can just like, yeah, like you know, be right next yeah. to me. That'll work. Alright. Oh, there's Blaze Blue right there. Uh, uh, just caught right by. Eat me, easy. At least it's not burger or taco salad cosplay. So we we'll go next. Polish and new cosplay. Polish and new cosplay. That's our goal for this year. Uh, CJ and uh, Kagome posing over there. But... Alright. I'll do it for now. Let's go back. This is me, Barry Burton, and we're just waiting for like SCR to like uh, put something back in the hotel room. Next right here we got Blondie. Hey Blondie. I can see myself in you. Well, yeah. And Zero for his stomach. Believe in me, who believes in you? I can't tell if I'm seeing you right now, but yeah, he's calming out right now, of course. There you go. Now, quick, open the door and do the dun 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 dun. <laughs> what? Dun 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 dun. You know. Open the door and do the... Who is it, dude? dude. <laughs> Who is it? Yeah, we're just waiting. We're gonna... Head to Doubletree first. That, I want that no, to be my outro zero, for my Anime North video. Zero is heading. Oh, the intro. I want that to be my outro. One, you're gonna open the door. Who is it? Oh, jeez. Oh. oh, man. Uh, so, <laughs> Doubletree for Zero? Yeah, because he has to pick up a panelist badge. Yeah, then we can, like, go to a bank or something. Around like, hopefully there'll be time where you just like wait in line for pre-register. Okay. Dragon fast. I could see uh, Death Metal Band. Playing this band. You saw Death Note Swagger? Uh, no. Death Metal Band playing this band. Oh, can they play it live better than Dragon Force? Probably. <laughs> I have no words to say to this, except we. Uh, me and Blondie were in the pre-reg line, which uh, we got in at, we have at least a pretty short line. Not that short, but definitely shorter than the non-pre-reg line, which SDR to go through. And regardless, both of the lines, by the time it was uh, about to just allow us to go in and get the badges, both lines were freaking huge. 
course, like, the non pre reg was much longer. Like, it had to, like, it didn't go around the building this time. It went around the parking lot. It seemed like it boxed it in. At least from here to me, uh, beyond, that's the pre registered line with Blondie. Right. Yeah. That is the end of the non pre reg. Well, you know, go ahead. They didn't do this last year. It just sort of wrapped around the building behind. Yeah, now they're gonna wrap around like the parking lot. Yeah, square up the parking lot. That's well. Unless they do some kind of like. Like five or five. I don't know if you have a line song, but you're scared. Feel bad for SCR. I don't like Oh my god, hi everybody, it's me, Sailor Moon behind us. Yeah. 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 Gonna be here for quite a while, but SCR is gonna be longer, so. Yeah. We'll, we'll go out and like meet him, like wait for him and all. Yeah, yeah. Right. It's almost time to go in and the non pre reg line got much bigger than before. It snakes around stopping right here. They probably got a crab or something, yeah. I want the rocket launcher for Tyrant. Can we go see Tyrant now? I haven't seen a tyrant yet. Yeah, that's a hard one. But yeah, um, yeah it, was, it was a pretty long way. And during that week, we met up with uh, Wiz again and a boy's friend. So. He, of course, Wiz was kind of like uh, surprised, I believe, that I made it because I kind of, that whatever. Yeah, he, he was just kind of happy that I made it and stuff. got the badges, I forgot to go to weapon check for uh, my uh, nerf gun I brought for Barry. So I had to go back in there with Wiz a little bit later. But before I even did that though, um, I was actually recognized by a couple people right there. Like, when I went to get a picture of a Jill and Claire, um, the cosplayer was doing Like, they recognize me as a bird. Yeah! Uh, so I got a picture of them, like, see them later. And later on, I actually found out that I was the only Barry Burton in the entire convention. Let alone since I'm from America. And, like, I was just, like, the only Barry Burton cosplayer. Like, there were Weskers, there was the Claire's, and Chris's, and uh, Jill's. Even a couple Leons, but I was the only Barry Burton. And I think one of the funniest parts was that um, some guy cosplaying as Big Boss or Snake from Elder Scrolls 3 <laughs> invited me to, or not really invited me, just said, You better be going to my Resident Evil panel. And I actually was planning to go to that, but that just made me confirm it. And that was the panel that was at the Sheridan. And the walk back was around the floor. The panel itself was uh, uh, pretty cool. I like, saw, like, of course, all the, all the other cosplayers I saw. It's like, hey, it's Barry. I'm like, yeah. The panel itself pretty much just talked about changes with the game series, favorite moments, and a bunch of other stuff. So, if you're a Resident Evil fan, this was a pretty good panel. After that, we just kind of, like, looked around and then went to stuff. We just took some videos and uh, pictures and all that. <laughs> 